Okay, today we're gonna to test out the 3080, the 99K of Battlefield 5 with ray tracing. Um, this is gonna be pure ray trace, uh, patch mark, 100% uh, resolution scaling, everything ultra, and yeah, ray tracing on. Uh, DLSS can only be used for 4K, so we won't be using it right now, but later on we do. So this is 1080p, and uh, let's see how the uh, how the system holds up. So we see 99% taxation, 110 FPS. It's pretty nice. Reflections are absolutely amazing though. Look at that. It's really, really good. Same for here. Yeah, look how, how high quality these reflections are. It's amazing. It's really good. Well, can't do much about that, you know? Yeah, so we see, this is like a full uh, circle of 64 players on top, but so we see about 110. I think that's the performance we're looking at right now. Let's, let's spawn it you know? Like, even the water reflections look really nice. Okay, let's move in. You can see that the GPU utilization drops down, so that basically means we have CPU bound to 1080p. There is some additional CPU overhead with ray tracing games, so if you want maximum performance ray tracing, it's not going to be it on uh, even GPU and CPU level. It's a shame that, you know, that it doesn't get advertised by anybody, but yeah, there is a, nice, a hit on CPU for sure. Look at these reflections, man, it looks really nice. Yeah, we're sitting at like a hundred now. Um, nice pop in there. Let's go. Oh, you saw me coming. So 90, 93. So it sits around the hundred FPS. That's what you can expect. It dips to 90s and we have upper hands towards like 120. Um, Let's say it's pretty good performance because the ray tracing is not easy to do. It's a shame that we're never going to date it with like DLSS 2.0, um, which this game could have really used. It's kind of weird actually that it didn't happen because uh, this game was like hugely sponsored. Well, the next Battlefield is probably coming out soon. Now, so. Yeah, there's that. Okay, so we're sitting on like 99, 100 FPS again. Sniper. Can't do anything against snipers with this gun. Let's see if we can find a player there. No. Anyway, we get the idea, I think. So, performance wise, let's move to 1440p and see how that performs like. Respawn, deploy, and let's move this way. Seems like the uh, hotel is uh, no longer a thing in our. Uh, yeah. We have to retake it, but it's probably not gonna happen, so. So we're sitting on land. The taxation with the GPU is a lot more better now, so we are actually GPU bound at this point. But we're still in like 80. Something like that. There's so many there. Holy shit. Yeah. By the sniper, I will probably be able to do it, but let's go up.
Too bad. So we should have hollered that PS here. It's a shame that I can't uh, get I can go there basically. Kinda want to see what the FPS is gonna be there, but Battlefield's extremely difficult to benchmark like this because the matches end, so I have to stop recording. I already tried to record it for like five, six times, and it just doesn't work because the matches are like really, really short. Uh, where am I? So we have that, and then points are getting taken over, which basically means there's no way for you to, yeah, get to the same place, really. And it doesn't help that this map particularly isn't really much used, it seems like. But I'm not sure how active Battlefield in general is. Well, there's like a while ago, I never really played it much. So, yeah. Okay, here we go. We are still at 80, so this is more demanding. But still, really nice reflections. 70 now. I got, I got the feeling that, that like this whole map is just sniper ending map. Point zero. Ooh, that was 60, 64. I must say it's really smooth. Like I think 40, 40p is doable, perfectly fine. Um, just don't expect like super high frame rates. Uh, 1080p is probably is more irritating at that point. So yeah. Okay, let's move out a little bit. 78 it's still perfectly smooth i think like if you sit around the 80 i think that with a g-sync screen that's like the sweet spot for uh for high demanding games yeah i must say yeah it works well uh, like one thing that i wish that these battlefield games had is that things are more responsive like for example, I walk it and I aim and I shoot. It's like there's this long delay in between all of them. I just want to have it like almost like a case, like instantly, you know, just the moment I click it, it just goes off instantly. It's a lot of like little delays like that. But yeah, the game's gonna always improve, you know. He's down. So let's move to 4K, uh, stand in this corner here, and then move to 4K and see how it holds up. Supply. Wrong button. So we're gonna do that again. Like the only game that really does this stuff correctly is Cyberpunk for some reason. Cyberpunk and Witcher are like really well done, well programmed on that front. Uh, every other game just feels like, yeah. Okay, let's put DLSS on and let's see what we got here. It, it, it needs to take a second to crawl up, I guess. Okay, here we go. This is the FPS you can expect. So we're sitting at 33 FPS. 32, 27, 25. Um, honestly, this is just not playable. Yeah, this is not playable at all. Let's uh, deploy. Uh, 47. Yeah, this is this is bad. Okay, well. We're pretty much solid as this, so let's put DLSS on. I don't think this is playable with DLSS, without DLSS. Let's see what uh, what changes that makes. Okay, let's wait a second until DLSS kicks in. Okay, here we go. So we're sitting out still 40, 50. Yeah, this, is, this, this is still bad performance, man. I'm not gonna lie, this is still bad performance. There's a door here. There actually is, yay! 60, maybe this is like a really 
art area or some shit. You know? But I'm not gonna lie, like this is not smooth. Maybe it's because of the rain though. I noticed that I'm far low performance right now because of rain. It's kinda weird. Can we get like rid of that shit? Let's see. No. We're in sixties now. Like this is this is I really wish I was on the other side of the team, just so that you can just roam around through the streets. But that's the problem you have with like multiplayer games like this is you're so dependent on what the team is doing. And it's so hard to like benchmark something. In a proper way. Because you also don't want to sit on an empty server because that also, you know, saves you a lot of performance. So it needs to be realistic, right? Because the FPS there is like way higher. See, it's like 70. This is like good playable. There's no problem here at all. And there's a sniper aim. Let's see if we can reach the other side here. Yeah. No, we probably can't. Oh wait, I can heal myself. Let's go. Oh, this guy is like... Okay, well... I pressed the wrong button it seems like. And it activated something. Here we go, we're back again. Yeah, they're like really, 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 really focused on me. Yeah. Snipers, man. Oh, so you acting with pistol. In short, it's playable at 4K, 60, 70 FPS. That's what you get. Maybe 80%. Maybe that area was just. I don't know. I did saw it drop to like 50. So. But now it seems to be stable. Maybe it was because the OSS had to kick in first. I don't know how Battlefield works. I do notice with DLSS 1.0, it takes a while before it actually enables. So maybe it's better now. Um, because this performance is perfectly acceptable. Um, for me, it's not for a shooter though. I want to have like a 100 plus. Um, about that. So even 4040p is like, hmm, it's not that great, but you know, it's doable. Um, but yeah, in short. Visually, it looks amazing. It's uh, it's nice to see that it's actually running at uh, all decent performance. So yeah, let's see if we can get up here, get away from that guy. Yeah, so uh, benchmark was a little bit longer um, because we were pushed into a corner. All in all, I think 4K now works perfectly fine. It's like 70%, 70, 80, which is perfectly fine performance. Um, 4040p is about 80, 90. 1080p is about like 100, 120. So I think 1080p, I will only just enable ray tracing. It adds something towards it. And yeah, it uh, performs really well on that front. Um, I do like the shadows, or I do like the reflections. It um, looks a lot better than the um, the baked reflections. It just looks odd, to be honest. But you know, you also have to try a huge amount of performance for it. 
should have that. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I will see you next time.